Panda Warriors! You guys like my ears? I got these, um, well, I, I saw them at Ikea way a while back, I think a year ago or something, and it was in the children's section, and, yeah, <laughs> knowing me, I would love something from the children's section of, like, of hats and everything, and when I saw it, it was, like, supposed to be part of this fairy tale book or whatever, and when I saw it, I was like, oh my god, I just want them, and then, like, of course, you know, the question comes from adults and everything, like, do you really need it? Is this something that you're gonna wear all the time? And in my head, at that time, I'd be like, yeah, I'm always gonna wear it. But in reality, I'll be like, I just want it around so that one day I will just want to wear it and make myself look like a goof. Or just, just, you know, it's a fun accessory. Now, why am I wearing this hat, you may say? Well, we are in October, and the year has gone by really fast. And I have still not fully decided what I'm gonna wear as an individual. I know me and my girlfriend, we're gonna dress up as, like, weird, stitched up dolls and everything, and I was already a doll for Halloween, but I am deciding that um, I'm going to upgrade it this year, maybe put more thought into it instead of last minute things, and hopefully uh, if I do some more comparison with it, I will look better this year. I will be on point, as people will say, because I'm trying to upgrade my vocabulary with uh, today's slang and everything, so I'm hoping that my costume for the doll one is on point. However, for the individual costume of myself going into work and dressed as whatever, I am still on the fritz about that because I don't know what I should wear. I don't know. I've been having so many ideas for it and I don't, I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't help that there's a Halloween contest at work also, so it's like, the pressure is on and I'm feeling it. I don't like it. I could be you, Lucy, for Halloween. Huh, puppy? Oh, you are just clenching out of fear. Huh, puppy? I can always go as Finn from Adventure Time. I mean, I already have the hat. I just need the clothes. Adventure Time, that's one. Or if I were to get technical and just give up on life, I could always go as a slutty version of Finn. I'm pretty sure at any Halloween store, there's costumes that can make you look slutty. That's one thing I want to talk about. So the other day, well not the other day, it was more like uh, last week uh, when me and my girlfriend were uh, going to Halloween, you know, the Halloween store and everything, because I always tell her, like, every time we walk by that store, at, Hall at the Spirit Halloween store where I live, I want to go in there to at least get more Halloween costume ideas. So, I walk in, the first costume section is like a Disney section of the store, and the first costume that I see is a Toy Story costume. And everyone knows how much a big fan I am of that movie, God Bless It's Heart and everything, amen. And... It's a Jesse costume. But I'm thinking, oh yeah, you know, Jesse and everything, you know, they have the hat correct. But not the outfit. Short shorts, a shirt that goes up to here and everything, and it's maybe want to do this a lot. Just, just this. Like uh, when I have kids and they want to dress very promiscuous on Halloween. I'm seriously going to put a potato sack on them and be like, there you go. You can be Mr. Potato Head. Happy Halloween. Just, just enjoy the whole day. I mean, Halloween comes once every year and, you know, like, don't spend all your time getting frustrated just because you want to look sexier than the next person next to you. Kind of, I'm kind of feeling this right now. I mean, I mean, these goggles are as big as my face, but I'm kind of feeling this. I don't know what I would call this. Kind of goes with my, my pajama shirt and everything. Hmm. Be like, trick or treat. <laughs> this is uh, this has been very enlightening and very fun. I always have fun doing these kind of things. You know, just nowhere. You know, I have spare time, not doing much or anything. But yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And you know, I'm pretty sure you guys all have wonderful, amazing ideas for Halloween. All in all, I just want you guys to have fun and be safe. You guys have until the 31st to come up with something. And I'm pretty sure you guys are going to be looking just f fucking awesome. So, I wish you guys all a good night. Or a good morning if you're in another country. And, yeah. Bye!